Uh, the future has never been brighter for America on the world stage. Agree? Yeah, I totally agree. I mean, this, this trip is largely successful just for this reason. Uh, and our viewers may not appreciate how much our allies have lost respect for us in terms of our reliability through the years of disengagement that President Obama did. So when President Trump did much the same thing in Europe and did much the same thing in the Middle East, reassuring our allies that the United States in its leadership role on a global stage is going to partner with our allies and defend their national interests as well as our national interests. And that message is really reverberating loud and clear. And we just saw it again here in the Far East. It's, it's the major part of the visit, certainly the second part of that visit, it's clearly the issue with, with, with North Korea and also the third part's our trade imbalance. But the, the major part of the visit is the reassurance to our allies that the United States will continue to exercise, once again, a global leadership role. So the word is that the Chinese are sending an envoy to North Korea. Uh, I believe they claim that there was no connection to the meeting that they just had with President Trump. But how significant is that? Well, I think that is significant, and it would have been wonderful if the president was able to say that in discussions with Pre 